Good morning and thank you for watching KDLT News. I'm Miranda Page. It's been more than a month since Hurricane Michael devastated parts of the East Coast and people are still cleaning up from the massive storm. A Sioux Falls swim team is doing their part to help out one of their own. The Sioux Falls Surge is collecting supplies for victims in Port St. Joe. The team has a connection there through a former teammate, Jack Gordon. Gordon now lives in the area with his girlfriend. The couple suffered minor damage to their home, but many of their neighbors lost everything. Now with the help from the Sioux Falls, they hope to rebuild their community. Our swim team is just one other example of what a wonderful community Sioux Falls is. The, the generosity that smaller towns and cities such as Sioux Falls and just in the state of South Dakota, what they bring when asked. All the supplies will be sent to the couple to distribute among their community where needed. Aaron, it got pretty chilly out. Do we have any chance of seeing the sun again? Don't worry, Miranda. We're going to see a lot of sun as we, as we start off this morning, but then we're going to see clouds increase, especially as we head into the late afternoon, the evening hours. We're going to be starting off cold. We're going to be starting off in the teens around Sioux Falls. Up north, yeah, single digits close to zero for a lot of us here this morning. 33, though. We should be back into the 30s by noon. We should top out close to 40 across a good chunk of the region, but of course, where we still have snow on the ground, yeah, we're going to be held back by that snow temperature-wise. As we look forward to the upcoming week, you know, I hear there may be a holiday coming up this week, so let's go ahead and take a look and take a quick peek and see what's coming up. A little bit cooler air is going to be pushing in from Monday. 34 is all we're going to see for a high. Not terrible at all because we'll back into the 40s on Tuesday. Lots of sunshine, a high of 42. And then heading into next week, oh my gosh, I just have such good news for you guys. 48 on Wednesday, even warmer. Thanksgiving looks like it's going to be about 50 degrees, lots of sunshine. And if you're going to go out for some deals coming up on Black Friday, yeah, we should be above freezing 34, 48 for a high on Friday.